Hi, Brian McCorder here from Safeopedia with another safety moment talking about procrastination versus urgency. Procrastination, don't you hate that? Um, but we all fall victim to procrastination from time to time. I meant to do this video last week, but I procrastinated. What are you going to do? Yeah, procrastination really kind of creeps up on us when things become complicated or we don't have a clear path on how to handle something. Complexity leads to procrastination, at least to self-sabotage. But when we know what to do, we tend to just go all Nike on it and just do it. So how do you create um, a sense of urgency when it comes to safety? And it's very important when it comes to safety. When someone uncovers a safety issue and it stays that way for a while, it becomes the new normal. Procrastination is a killer of safety initiatives. So it's very important to have that sense of urgency. So again, how do we go all Nike on it? Well, one way is having clear set standards. When a safety issue is uncovered, an unsafe behavior or condition, you need mechanisms in place to be able to deal with it quickly. And there are often tools that we can use for this, uh, such as simple check sheets, having people look over their work areas and follow a simple check sheet of you no know, slip trip hazards, tools are put up, guards are in place. You know, we want to create systems that are self-regulating, self-monitoring, and self-correcting. This is the goal of a system. When you have a good system in place, you don't have to worry because that system is going to keep you in check. You want tools in place where if a person does find an unsafe condition, they can report it immediately and then you should have kind of a clock starts ticking of we need to have this fixed as soon as possible. And you might need short term and long term goals. Say that uh, there's a piece of tile that's broken on the floor. It's going to be a while before we can replace it. So you know what? We're going to put a cone there to at least draw people's attention to it short-term and then long-term fixes. So, so once again we need set standards and then we just need tools in place that employees can use to help report and correct unsafe conditions and behaviors. We want that sense of urgency and we want to discourage procrastination which tends to again be there in the lack of tools and set standards. Until next time, Brian McCorder with Safeopedia. Stay safe.